Hello. Have you ever looked up at the night sky and wondered what's out there? Space exploration is all about trying to find out. People send rockets and spaceships up into space to learn more about all the cool things up there. This includes things like looking at the stars and planets, studying comets and asteroids, and sending probes to other parts of the solar system. People do this to learn more about the universe and the things that are in it. Some people also want to colonize, or live on, other planets. Earth is getting pretty crowded, and some people think that we might need to find somewhere else to live someday. But right now, we don't have the technology to live on other planets for long periods of time. We need to figure out how to create an environment that's livable and sustainable. When it comes to space exploration, there are a lot of things that people have to think about. First of all, space is really big. Space exploration is expensive and time-consuming. It takes a lot of resources to explore space, and it's a long way away. But people are willing to put in the effort because there's so much to learn. We're constantly discovering new things about space, and it's an exciting field to be a part of. Also, space is a really harsh environment. There's no air, water, or food up there, so people have to bring everything they need with them and they have to wear special suits to protect them from the cold and lack of air. Space is also full of radiation and other dangers, so it's important to be careful. But even with all these challenges, people still explore space because there's so much to learn. We sent rovers to Mars to study the planet and see if there's any evidence of life there. We've also sent telescopes up into space to take pictures of things that are really far away, like black holes and other galaxies. When it comes to colonizing other planets, that's a whole other story. Right now, we don't have the technology to live on other planets for long periods of time. We need to figure out how to grow food, make water, and create a livable environment. But that doesn't mean people aren't trying. Scientists and engineers are working hard to figure out how we can live on other planets someday. And who knows? Maybe you'll be one of the first people to live on Mars. In order to colonize other planets, we'd have to build habitats, or places where people can live. These habitats would need to have everything people need to survive, like air, water, and food. It also means creating habitats that can protect people from the harsh environment of space. One of the biggest challenges of colonizing other planets is creating a source of food. We need to figure out how to grow crops in an environment that doesn't have any soil, water, or air. Some ideas include using hydroponics or growing food in greenhouses that are shielded from the harsh conditions of space. We're still working on this, but there's a lot of research going on. Another challenge of colonizing other planets is creating a source of water. Water is essential for life, but it's not easy to find in space. We might need to find ways to extract water from the environment or create our own sources of water. Creating a livable environment also means protecting people from the radiation and other dangers of space. This might mean building habitats underground or creating protective barriers around them. We need to find ways to keep people safe in an environment that's very different from Earth. There are a lot of different ideas for how to create a livable environment on other planets. Some people think that we should terraform the planet, which means changing the environment to make it more like Earth. Others think that we should create closed ecosystems that can support human life. In addition to exploring and colonizing other planets, people are also studying space to learn more about the universe as a whole. We're studying things like dark matter and dark energy, which make up most of the universe but are invisible to us. We're also studying the early universe to learn more about how it formed. There are also a lot of international collaborations in space exploration, Different countries work together to share resources, knowledge, and technology. This helps us to achieve more than we could on our own and to make progress in the field of space exploration. To sum it up, space exploration is all about learning more about the universe we live in. And colonizing other planets is about finding a new place for humans to live someday. It's a big challenge, but scientists and engineers are up for it. Who knows what we'll discover next?